Welcome to our video on the European Union. Today, we'll be taking an in-depth look at the history, structure, and policies of the EU. The European Union, or EU, is a political and economic union of 27 European countries. The idea for the EU was first proposed after World War II, to promote peace and cooperation between European nations. In 1957, the Treaty of Rome was signed, establishing the European Economic Community, which laid the foundation for the EU as we know it today. The EU has played a significant role in promoting stability and prosperity in Europe, through policies such as the single market, the euro currency and the freedom of movement of people, goods, and services. The EU has also expanded to include new member states, which has helped to promote democracy and human rights in these countries. The EU has several key institutions that work together to make and implement policy. In this section, we'll take a closer look at each of these institutions and their roles within the EU. The European Council, made up of the leaders of all EU countries, sets the overall direction of the EU. The Council meets at least four times a year to discuss pressing issues and make decisions on the EU's agenda. This powerful institution sets the direction for the EU's work, and acts as a forum for leaders to come together to discuss the most pressing issues facing the EU today. The European Commission, made up of one representative from each EU country, is responsible for proposing laws and managing the day-to-day -day work of the EU. The Commission also acts as the guardian of the EU treaties, ensuring that EU countries abide by their commitments. This institution is the engine that drives the EU's work and plays a crucial role in shaping the policies that affect the lives of EU citizens. The European Parliament, the European Parliament, made up of elected representatives from all EU countries, represents the interests of EU citizens and has the power to approve or reject proposed laws. It also has the power to approve the EU budget and hold the Commission accountable for its actions. The European Parliament is the voice of EU citizens and plays an important role in shaping the EU's policies and holding its institutions accountable. The European Court of Justice, the European Court of Justice is responsible for interpreting EU laws and ensuring that they are applied consistently. The Court also settles legal disputes between EU countries and institutions. This important institution serves as a safeguard for EU citizens and businesses, ensuring that EU laws are applied fairly and consistently across all member states. The EU economy one of the main focuses of the EU is to promote economic growth and stability within its member countries. The EU operates a single market, which allows goods, services, people, and money to move freely between countries. This helps to promote trade and economic growth within the EU. Additionally, the EU has a common currency, the euro, which is used by 19 of its member countries. This has brought about economic stability and made it easier for people to travel and do business within the EU. The EU also provides funding for research and development, education, and cultural exchange programs. Foreign and Security Policy the EU also works to promote peace and stability in Europe and around the world. It has a common foreign and security policy and participates in peacekeeping and humanitarian efforts. The EU also works to address global challenges such as climate change, migration, and terrorism. The EU works to promote peace and stability, human rights, and democracy all over the world. EU and international trade the EU is a major player in the global economy and is one of the world's largest trading partners. The EU has trade agreements with countries around the world and works to promote free trade and fair competition. The EU also works to protect the rights of workers, consumers, and the environment in international trade. Current Challenges and Developments Despite its many achievements, the EU is not without its challenges. The ongoing economic crisis, the refugee crisis, and the UK's decision to leave the EU, have all put pressure on the EU. Additionally, the rise of populist and nationalist movements in some EU countries have raised concerns about the future of the EU. However, the EU has shown a remarkable ability to adapt and overcome challenges in the past and will continue to do so in the future. From its history and institutions to its policies and challenges, we hope this video has given you a deeper understanding of this important institution. The EU may not be perfect, but it has brought peace, prosperity, and stability to Europe for over 60 years 
and it will continue to do so for many years to come. Thanks for watching.